Right, so that's a pretty hard level from what I remember, that one. Uh, where to now? Okay, I think we return to the ship now. I really want to get a lot done. Right, by the time you guys see this video, this probably won't matter now, but I'm actually going to be really busy over the next couple of weeks. So, I'm going to try and get as much done as possible. Right, did I want to do that? Probably not. Ah, here we go. This teleporter wasn't here last time. Was it? I really don't know. Let's enter this facility. No way. We're gonna go back first and buy some ammo. No, that's not an ammo vendor, that's a thingy vendor. Uh, what do we want to buy ammo for? Seeker gun, lava gun. Should I just buy the rocket tube? Oh, I'm tempted. Saw that. Just so we have another gun to upgrade, you know? Right, I think this was my favorite weapon with Ratchet and Clank 3 online. Look at it go. <laughs> Is that upgrading actually? When I kill those things, it better be. Right, some proper platforming to be done here. that rocket ship. Oh, I'm going to have to alter the quick select, aren't I? And we'll swap over the Lancer. Saw that. I really don't think you get experience for those things, actually, because it doesn't seem to be going up even by a little... Well, mind you, I suppose this thing does take a long time to upgrade. Probably won't upgrade it until you get into your second game, you know? Ow. Right, we won't bother with these things, we'll just go right here. Onto this elevator. Elevator. Man, this really brings back memories, because I can just mind at this point I was sort of questioning the fact whether or not, when playing the demo, you know, I'm sort of questioning the fact whether or not this game would be better than the uh, first one, you know? And to be honest, I was, I was right, it's not... I don't know, I don't know what I like better, this one or the first one. Either way, 3 dominates both of them easily, but... Right, continue point. Oh god, I remember this actually. The core terminal. Let's see what we can get from it. Do I have enough? Power appears to be out in this entire area. You're right. I better call a maintenance bot. Let's just follow him and fix it ourselves. Mm, yeah, I don't remember being too impressed by that humor in the demo. Right, there's actually a uh, skill point 
a gold platinum bolt thing or a nanotech upgrade was it for uh, at the end of this uh, at the end of this thing you can do like rotate 180 degrees and go all the way back through this the other way you know Right, we use this thing again. Haven't used this in a while, have we? There we go. Right, and if I remember correctly, there's a completely pointless room back here. Yep, it's completely... Well, actually, I think this is how you turn 180 degrees, maybe. Because if you turn 180 degrees, there was a nanotech upgrade at the first room, and up there is a platinum bolt! I won't bother getting them, though, you know. Now, let's get the goods on that experiment. Ten grand! I think I see the problem. What? Now even the computers are charging us? That's it. This galaxy blows. Indeed it does, Ratchet. Dr. James T. Fullbladder reporting Thank on God Medicorp that Experiment enough, number 13. This update is strictly classified. If you are watching this, you're fired. Early <laughs> thinking held that the specimen was entirely docile in nature. Even overt provocation failed to incite it. But the late Dr. Putrid's son observed that natural levels of monster propanase in the experiment's bloodstream were triggering some remarkable changes. Attempts at neutralizing the specimen's violent tendencies were met with limited success. Our surviving staff recommend that the experiment be destroyed immediately at Megacorp's deep space disposal facility. The computer's log indicates that we were the first to view that recording. So Fizz Widget must not know. We've got to warn him. Yellow. Mr. Fizzwidget, you're safe! Sir, brace yourself. We just saw a video of your experiment eating its handlers. I repeat, it eats its handlers! Ah, yes. Uh, low fat, extra foam, no sprinkles. Mr. Fizzwidget, do you copy? Anyone handling the experiment must exercise the utmost caution. No, no, uh, decapitated. <laughs> what? Oh, yes, yes. Exercise my frontmost cushion. Yeah! <laughs> Sir, your experts recommend that the experiment be liquidated. We will meet you at your deep space disposal facility. Ah, yes, my cheap date proposal facsimile. It's heavily guarded, so make sure to use the password. Which is, uh, oh, uh, <laughs> Quartastic, yes. Toodaloo. Uh, Quartastic, okay then. Let's go to that place, shall we? And we only have 10,000 bolts left. Never gonna get that bouncer, am I? I guess you gotta work for things like that, though. Right. Uh, we'll do this. We'll do. We can go to two levels. We'll go to Fizz Widget's thing first, though. This is one of the... I think it is the best looking level in the game, if I remember correctly. For less. Pay for six hits and the seventh is free. You want us to what? Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. That'd be a, an unethical conflict of interest. What kind of scum do you think we are? Say, that is a lot of bolts. <clears throat> well, the, since you put it that way, I suppose we could... Uh, Undo our previous obligation. Excellent, sir. Thank you for choosing Thugs for Less. <clears throat> Attention all Thugs for Less personnel. We now have a new employer. Oh, crap. 